Hello everyone, welcome back to Scott's Honest Reviews and today we are reviewing the 2-in-1 beard straightening brush and men's hair styler. Um, I do want to point out that a lot of women have actually also bought this as well and have used this. So it says customized for men's beard and hairstyle but I have seen women use this for their hair as well. So keep that in mind but it is, does say for men. So let's get unboxing and like always you can find this product in my video description. So if you want to buy it you can go ahead and check out the link in my video description. I love the black in I think it's black and gold. It might be a little lighter gold. So here you go. Nice simple style. Let's go ahead and turn it on to show you guys how it works. It's very, very basic. Make sure to always read the warning labels that come with it. Like on here, there's a warning label which it says do not touch the hot comb teeth after heating please do not press the comb teeth against your skin and be cautious to avoid scolding during use this comb is not suitable to the wet hair or beard so if it's soaking wet you do not want to use it guys keep that in mind alright let's go ahead and plug her in alright First, let's go and show you up close. It's very nice. So, turn it on. Just simply press up. And we can feel it heating up already. So guys, we're going to go over a couple of things here. So, this is rapid heating. It says preheat for 60 seconds, so you want to turn it on and you don't want to use it right away, you want to wait 60 seconds, uh, then straighten the beard, volumize the hair, you know, all kinds of different things. You can slowly go to the left, right, whatever you want to do. Uh, it says high and low temperatures, so on here, there's black little buttons, so when you push it up the whole way, that would be, I would assume, high. So, uh, yeah, and... So if you want your style to last longer, please use beard oil or hair styling lotion. Um, and it says, special note, it will have a slight smell of plastic for the first use. It will disappear after several uses. So in order to keep clean and no smell, please remove any hair from the brush before your next use. You can use the dry slash wet cloths to clean the brush but required to turn the brush off so make sure you have the brush off and it's not hot when you're cleaning it so that's basically it there's a couple more things on here you guys can read and check out but we're gonna go ahead and let 60 seconds pass and then use it so I had just to trim my beard and um, cut my hair not too long ago so it's probably not gonna work super well but So that's just basically what you do, you know, when you have longer hair and a beard, obviously, for such shorter hair, it doesn't really work too super well. But you can see that it is making it nice um, and not as ratty looking. So you can see it makes it nice and straight. So if you want to use gel or something, um, like it said, you can, but it definitely makes your hair look more smooth and silky um, than before. So, you know, we'll have to test it out more when we, our hair is longer again, but be careful because you can burn your hand. This gets really hot. So when you turn it off, make sure you, you don't set a towel over this or anything. Um, just keep that in mind. So, I can give this... You know, it, it actually did make my hair 
really soft and definitely um, much smoother um, than before. So overall, you know, I can give this. I think it's will work pretty good um, with longer hair, and it seems to operate really well. Just be careful; you can burn yourself. So. I'm giving this an 8 out of 10 because of the overall style, it's small, it works good. Um, so yeah, it gets an 8 out of 10. Thank you guys for watching and hope this video helped you out deciding if this is a good product or not. But for me, it seems like it is, but be careful, you can burn yourself. It gets very, very, very hot, so please be careful.